Hey y'all, welcome back to another banking video. And if you're new here, welcome to my channel. So in today's video, as you can tell, I'm gonna be doing a five and below unboxing. So I went here because a lot of people had told me that um, they sold a lot of like good gifts for Christmas, especially for like their bag fillers, you know? Like I always like to give a really big gift to each of my nieces and nephews. And then I like to fill it with like, little you know like bubbles or coloring books or like little toys so i'm not gonna lie i went to five and below and they had quite the um variation and i was really happy they had like really good toys i mean these are toys that like i feel like you could like put a bow on it and call it a day so i was really really impressed so i'm super excited to show you guys um this video is not sponsored by any means these are like genuinely you know my reaction right now to me unboxing everything and truthfully like what i personally picked out at the store that i felt like my personal nieces and nephews would enjoy um uh, sorry if i look a bit crazy the holiday season has me worn out i mean it's gonna be like 10 p.m and i am still sipping some coffee because i am just like this season always gets me and I feel very blessed this year because I feel like I've been able to purchase a lot of things that I've wanted to get my nieces and nephews or like my mom, my sister, my brother. So I feel very, very um, fortunate um, and just blessed, honestly, very humbled. And so, yeah, let, we're just going to go ahead and get into it. Remember the holiday season, although it's fun for some, it is a harder chance for others. Um, so always spread love, kindness, and joy because you never know what someone's going through. And if you do have any toys, now that this is the season where a lot of kids do get new toys, make sure to give your other like old toys to, you know, you can donate them, you can give it to kids in need, stuff like that. Because there are kids out here who, unfortunately for the holidays, don't get anything. So we want to make sure it is, you know, being spread around. So yeah, like I said, let's get into this. $5, I was extremely impressed. Five and Below isn't somewhere where I shop a lot, but maybe I should. So we're gonna start off with this toy right here. This is like a, what is it, like a airplane? It's called a Cobra Flyer. It's a remote control helicopter. $5 for a remote control helicopter? Hello, hello. I mean, <laughs> Remote control anything is always like 20 bucks for like a, a small toy. So I was really, really impressed with this one. Like I said, I was just impressed overall. I'm going to put this here. I was just impressed like overall with all the finds that I got. Um, but especially like a, a good quality toy like this. So that's how the back looks. It has the blades and everything. Um, it includes the helicopter, the control, a charging cable the instruction sheets, um, and yeah, they had it in different colors. They had like black, they had, I think white or yellow. And then I just got the green one because this is for my nephew and he always, all his remote control, everything is black and white and stuff or red. So I wanted to do something different and this gives me like army vibes. So I'm not gonna lie. This is a really good toy for like, you can literally give this, give this to somebody, like put a bow on it, wrap it up, whatever, as a gift and call it a day. And for five bucks, like, hello. So he's going to be getting that. Then I don't, my next gift, I do not promote violence, by the way. <laughs> but it is, um, it's a ball blaster, okay? So it's not like, you know, I don't think I can say the word, but y'all know what I'm referring to. It's a ball blaster, okay? And this is for my other nephew who that he loves, like, you know, beep, 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 like he'd be doing that all over the house and stuff. So now he can get a, an official ball blaster, okay? It comes with the balls, you put it in here and I guess he blasts it. And I don't know, I just thought it was a really cute toy for him as well. And don't be fooled, like these are their main toys too. Like I'm not like getting them something super extravagant and adding this cause <laughs> auntie don't have money like that. Uh, so this is gonna be really like their main toys. I might get them like a little extra candy or something, but these are, these are their gifts, okay? So yeah, I got him this. And then the cutest thing, his sister, which is my niece, and she just so happens to be the one I'm closest to, which I don't do favoritism, but I do everything with that little girl. So, you know, it's... when I saw this, I was like, I had already bought her her Christmas gift, but I was like, 
guys. Okay. When I saw this one for her, I was like, I mean, look at it. It's a unicorn ball blaster as well. It says push to shoe. It's a unicorn. It's, I'm sorry. It's a unicorn blaster. It's not a ball blaster. It's a unicorn blaster. Here are the little balls. You put it in the mouth and then the unicorn like shoots it out. And the thing is that her and her brother play really rough. And like my niece is a girly girl, but don't get me wrong. She has a tomboy side and she knows how to put a good fight back. So I was like, if I'm getting this for her brother, this was in the same bin. I was like, like, I'm gonna get it for her sister so that they can play together. Because what happens is if I only give it to him, he'll blast it at her and she won't be able to defend herself. If I only give it to her, she'll blast it at him. He won't be able to defend himself. And he's a little bit older though. And I know some of you guys are probably like, then don't get it for either or. They will blast each other with like anything though. So at least this is like the official like game. They'll blast each other with their food. And like, I'll, I'll have like cook something and they'll blast it. And I'm like, uh-uh. So I was like, no, no, no. Let's just stick to like when we're playing this, we can blast each other. But if not, then no. And I'm not promoting none of that violence or anything. It's just like these little balls, they, they don't hurt. They're like ping pong balls and stuff. But yeah, so I got them each one. And I thought that that would be such a cute gift for them to each, each have their own. She'll have the unicorn one and he'll have the regular one. And I'm so excited to give them this because I know, like even though I had, like I said, her gift, I just know that they're going to use that. So I had to, you know, I had to get them one. I did get an extra one though because I have my other nephew and I'm not going to lie. I was like, mm, I felt bad if I didn't get him one. So I went back and purchased him one. So yeah, he has that. Um, so I got, I honestly got two of those and now I'm thinking, I'm like, maybe I should have gotten a fourth one though, because my nephew has a little brother and they might fight for, uh, child. it's always like, if you got one, one thing, you got to get the other one, the same thing. So I'd be dealing with that a lot. Next up. Oh my God. I feel like I'm so tan. I went out tanning today because I was so stressed. I needed to just lay there and get vitamin C vitamin d i was just like oh my god i was like exhausted from all this christmas talk so i'm feeling a little burnt but anyway next up mm, this is so cute look at her look at her she's so cute so this i did get for my niece as well because it matched the whole like unicorn vibe that i was going for and she is obsessed with stuffed animals. Like anyone who gives her a stuffed animal, she's like, okay, time to add you into the collection. Her collection takes up a whole bed. She can't even sleep in her bed because that's how bad her collection is. But she refuses to give away any toy that somebody has like gifted her or like any stuffed animal that somebody has gifted her because to her, it has a special meaning. So she always thinks of me, I'm, she's like, you're always such a sparkly cupcake, a sparkly unicorn. Like she always thinks I'm like, so I thought that this was cute. It's like a little furry, like cute little, I think it gives me cupcake vibes and it's like winking like, you know, and I do that to her. Bro, it just reminded me of her. I wasn't gonna get it because I keep, every time I go to the store, everything reminds me of my little niece, Scarlett. And like, I'm always like, oh, I'll just get it for Scarlett. Oh, I'll just get it for Scarlett. Next thing you know, I'm like, <laughs> it's, it's bad. But you know, she's she's my little princess. So I don't know. I. This is not a cupcake. This is like a cookie. Is that like vanilla in the middle? I don't know what this is, okay? Maybe it's a burger. I don't know, but she'll figure it out. And I, I just wanted her to be like, be reminded of me. So I wanted to get her one because she's never had one. And so I just wanted her to get one so that she could be like reminded of me. So yeah, I thought this was really, really cute. And so she can sleep with it at night. Um, Next up. <laughs> Next up, I got this Squishmallow 2. I forgot who this is all for at this point. Like, at this point, I don't even know who's getting what. I think one of these was for my... Is, who is this for? I forgot, like, who I'm buying what for now. Guys, I have about six, seven... I have two, four, six... I have seven nieces and nephews. So, yeah, you can see how there might be a little bit of confusion of, like, who gets what. So, 
I'm trying to think. I don't know who it's for right now, but I know that I have bought it with good intentions to give it to one of my nieces and nephews. So we have this one right here, which is a cute little like bunny. Is that a bunny? I don't know what that is. It's a Squishmallow. It's adorable and it has the big ears. It's so, so cute and a little scarf because it's cold. And then this is, this reminds me of a cat that she has, which she named Pusheen. Pusheen, is it? Maybe that's like their actual name. I don't know. But anyway, this is like a cat squishmallow, which I, <laughs> I don't know like who, because I need to give one. I don't have three girls. I only have two girls in the family. So one of these squishmallows is supposed to go to a boy. That's cute. So, yeah. I don't know. This is a cute Squishmallow. Um, and, yeah. I got it at Five and Below. It's like a little cat. It's adorable with its green little stuff. I think this is for my boy nephew. I think I'm going to give him both of this together. Yeah, probably. All right. Next up... I got, oh, well, I have gotten these. These are just like wine um, bottles. I make coquito during Christmas time and I give it away as gifts. So this is not really for kids, but look how cute the bags are with the little Santa. I thought this was like a really, really cute bag. And it has like glitter on it kind of, if y'all can kind of see. And then I got this one and it says there's magic inside. Yeah, because there's going to be lick in this <laughs> inside these bottles so there's magic inside y'all gonna get lit off of the lick period so yeah i thought these were adorable and i purchased them um i also got this Krabby patty like holiday um mixed gummies candy whatever because who doesn't like gummies and candies and stuff during christmas time so i got that as well because you know kids love gummies and whatnot i also got My brother's favorite candy is Sour Patch, and I come through every single year. During the year, he plays baseball, and he takes it very seriously, and he's at that age right now where he's getting offers and stuff, scholarships, all that. So he's very strict on his diet throughout the year. He doesn't really munch on candy or munch on pretty much anything that's not too healthy. So on Christmas or on his birthday holidays, I like to kind of emphasize on whatever he specifically likes because that's like the one time he'll break his diet or like his healthy eating, whatever. So he loves, 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 loves Sour Patch. So y'all already know I got him the family size Sour Patch thing. And for $5, I thought it was pretty good. So I'm going to put this in his gift bag. So that one, I know that one's for my brother. Then for one of my nephews, he loves like Taki. Um, he loves Takis, like anything spicy. So when I saw these, these are the Takis Explosion. I purchased it for him. I don't think this is worth $5, like this little bag right here. I don't know if they charge me $5 or how much they charge me for the Takis. Let's see how much the Takis bag was. The Takis bag were $2. Okay. I mean, I guess, yeah, for $2 is fine. But yeah, it's Takis Explosion, which are supposed to be more spicy than the regular ones. When I tell you that boy is obsessed with the regular Takis, he's just like his auntie. Like, I love regular Takis, but he likes, like, really, really spicy things, like, even more than me. So, I figured that these are Takis, but to the next level, and I thought he would really, really enjoy them. So, obviously, I got these for him because I just thought it would be cute to add into the bag. He's going to get this, the Ball Blaster. Um, I got him some underwear and I don't know what else, but yeah, he's 13. But like I said, I know he'll enjoy this because kids like, like chips and candies and all that stuff. And the spicier, the better for my little boy. So I got him that. And I like how it's not super big because then they're going to blow up the bathroom. Like, let's be honest. Okay. Talkie's explosion. This is going to lead him into the bathroom. So it's good that it's not too much um up next oh here's another little wine bottle it says spreading good cheers i'm not gonna lie i had not like seen what i purchased i purchased this at the very beginning like i was like i'm not gonna be one of those late christmas shoppers why because i always forget something so despite me not being like a, a late or a last minute christmas shopper i still end up last minute christmas shopping because i forget something i forget somebody like 
I, I'll write a list and I'll still forget something like I don't know I try to be organized I try I, it's getting better throughout the years next year I think I'll really nail it but this year I did not nail it I'm not gonna cap I did not nail it this year um but I got this a few weeks ago so I forgot I had forgot everything I purchased but yeah this is really cute it says spreading good cheer and it's like a bottle of milk but that's gonna be like a bottle of poquito so I'm, like, I'm excited I know exactly who I'm gonna give this to yeah i'm gonna be making coquito bottles to give out then i just purchased this this was a dollar at the five dollar store it's like to get hairs off of your things because i have a husky and right now during winter time she be shedding she be shedding she know what she be doing to my clothes i can't even wear black anymore so it's like and i'm always in black so i need this so i can just take off her hairs off of me and for a dollar i thought it was a really really good price um then i bought i bought this little tree skirt which not thinking about it i might go return it because it's just a regular like plaid tree skirt and the dollar store has this though and i paid five dollars for this and it's like whatever it's giving me whatever vibes it's not even all that cute so yeah i'm probably gonna return this but it's supposed to be a tree skirt for like a mini tree that I have in my room. So next up, I purchased this bucket hat. I feel like bucket hats are really in right now. Oh my God. <laughs> I saw some really cute ones at Forever 21 also. And they were in the $5 section. So they would have also been five bucks. But yeah, I got this at the $5 store. And I really liked it because it was white and furry. So it was very much giving winter vibes. And you know, this is I'm filming this a few days before Christmas. So I feel like I can wear this on Christmas or on Christmas Eve. So I really, really liked it. Obviously, I'm wearing a bun right now, so you can't really like see, but it's given. Like if my hair was down, it's given. If my hair is not down right now, so that's why it looks kind of weird. But anyway, yeah, I thought for five dollars it was cute. It's one size fits all, and like I said, Forever 21 had a few, and they looked cute, but not as cute as this one, and it was for the same price. So I got a little bucket hat, and this is very much for me. Uh, my friend will probably steal it and want to wear it too because she's like my sister and she's always here but that's my gift to myself and last but not least i got the cutest pet and owner hats so i'm gonna be doing a separate haul where i do like dog items where i show you guys the dog toys and dog treats that i bought from my dogs and my best friend's dogs um for christmas but yeah this um i have purchased at the five dollar store and the owner hat which would be for me is this one right here it says nice and i'm just gonna wear it probably with my hair down and then for luna which is my dog she has a little hat here that says naughty and then it has this strap so i can really like hold it on her so that it won't fumble and this is for when we take photos because i'm gonna do like little christmas photos with my husky luna and they're gonna come out mad cute i already know so yeah i'm very very excited um to give it to take these photos with her and to wear these little hats because they're matching hats and i know that it's gonna look great in the pics so i'm really excited about that and you guys will see more items of that i got my dog because i got her like little boots and stuff and like outfits also but that will be in the dog haul so make sure you stay in tuned but with that being said that concludes today's video today's haul um i'm not gonna lie five and below hello like five and below really did their thing they really outdid themselves because i did not think that i could find everything that i found um or that it would genuinely have been five dollars i was like this is a scam they're gonna charge me like 20 bucks for each item and i was really really impressed and there were so many more things in there it just so happens that i had already done majority of my christmas shopping prior to arriving at five and below so i didn't want to like keep adding stuff but yeah, nevertheless, I still added quite a few things, but they're very adorable and I know that the kids will love and appreciate it. So I am super, super excited. Um, I wanna thank you guys for watching today's video. Make sure to stay in tune for more videos to come and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I hope you all have a wonderful holiday season. Remember, it's not the gift that counts, it's the thought. So as long as you put some thought and effort, it doesn't really matter how much you spend. I'll see you guys in my next video. Thanks so much for watching and don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Bye.